Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a Native American headdress. I'm going to take two fingers on the left and put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a curved line down, come back to the dot, draw a straight line up, curve line down, and leave this floating. Inside the floating I'm going to draw a circle, I'm going to draw inside another circle and inside there I'm going to draw another circle. I come back over here to the left and I'm going to draw one, two little straight lines. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two little straight lines. Everybody might end up with a different count because we all draw differently. I come back to the first set and I just draw a little slightly curved line across the top. All the way down. Now, in between each of these little uh, sections, I'm going to draw one, two, three curved lines. One, two, three curved lines. One, two, three. 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 Now I come back to the top again and I'm going to draw from each one of those double lines. I'm going to go one curved line, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I come back to the first one and I draw a curve line up, connect, curve line down. Curve line up, connect, curve line down. Curve line up, connect, curve line down. Curve line up, connect, Curve line down, curve line up, connect, curve line down, curve line up, connect, curve line down, whoops, down, curve line up, connect, curve line down, curve line down, connect, curve line, connect. At the tip of each one, I'm going to draw little slightly curved line going out and like I said everybody's is going to be a little bit different because we all draw different sizes. Now I come to the very tip and I go straight diagonal and straight diagonal. So you go down, up, down, up, down, 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 down. They change directions as we go further and further, but basically you're just drawing two little straight diagonal lines at the end of each tip. Now, I come back on the inside and I go zig, zag, zig, zag, zig, zag. And I come to this section and I'm going to mimic this line. So I draw a little straight line down, curve line down, little straight line connect. Right here at the end I'm going to draw one curve line out, one curve line in the middle, one curve line out. Starting at the first one. Wavy, wavy, wavy line point wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. Second one, wavy, 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 wavy line point, wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. Last one, wavy, wavy, wavy line point, wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. Okay. 
Now we're going to do a little bit, oh, sorry, let's add our straight diagonals at the end of each of the tips of these. Now, the last thing we're going to do is add one, two, three, four, five little straight lines. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Opposite side, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. They're all going to be different. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. 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 And again, everybody's is going to look a little bit different because we all draw differently. Now on the bottom ones, I just go one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. I know that's a lot, but the drawing is more difficult than the coloring. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, each one of these is a feather, and each one of the feathers is tipped with black. So all these little straight diagonals that ended up on the tip, those are your demarcations so you know that this section should be black. Even the ones down here, same thing. These should also be tipped in black. Okay? Then, this top part of the diagonal, I mean a zigzag, that should be black. I think that's it. Then, we come in with red, and we do this section, this line, this part of the diagonal. This should all be red. This little donut part of the circle, that should be red. Then we come in with the brown. And we're going to do our little double spaces. These little one, two lines all the way down. And then we're going to do the middle of the section going all the way down. And we're going to do the outside donut shape of our circles. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Here's my Native American headdress all colored in. And that's it. Okay, bye-bye.